Oh, hey YouTube, me again. Um, yeah, so I'm, I guess, a little over a week on tea now. Um, I had my second tea shot a couple days ago. Uh, it, yeah, it went fine. Uh, my, my partner injected me again. Um, and this time, they let us take home my tea so I can do it in the comfort of my own home now, which is nice because going to the doctors um, a couple times a week was getting a little, little old. So yeah, uh, two doses of tea in, uh, still not really seeing any changes, but you know, that's, uh, that's probably has a lot to do with the, the low dose. Um, are some changes starting that you, you, the viewer, can't see? Um, and I think all the trans guys watching this know, know what I'm talking about. Um, holy fuck. <laughs> I mean, I knew it was coming. I knew it was usually the first thing that happened, and uh, and I was I was in, I'm into it. No, sure, bring it on. But holy fuck, like overnight, you guys, damn. And uh, you know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go too much into it. But uh, just. Uh, you know, I was I was ready. I was ready for it to happen. I was not prepared for the chafing. So let it be known for all the pre-tea guys out there. Prepare yourself for that. Pick yourself up some of this, some lanolin cream. You're gonna want it. That's enough about that. <laughs> um, yeah. So. Um, I wanted to talk a little bit about you know how how I got this far and um, how, how I knew. It seems like everybody has a, a how I knew video, so this is mine. Um, I, I really like to say as much, as often as I can, that I, I didn't always know. For a long time I had absolutely no fucking glue, to be honest. Um, and I think that's important to say because um, we're really used to hearing only one kind of trans narrative, you know, this whole, oh, I was trapped in the wrong body and I've I've known since I was a little kid, and, and certainly that happens to a lot of people. Um, but for a lot of people, it's not like that. It's a it's a really complicated journey to get here. And so for for a really long time, I I struggled with the idea that I wasn't trans enough to be trans because I hadn't, you know, <laughs> told my mom when I was four years old. Um, and yeah, um, what happened. I don't even really remember how I came to be because this was just such an intense moment for me. Um, but I, it hit me like a fucking shit ton of bricks one day. I was sitting in my god awful little basement suite that I lived in at the time, and um, suddenly something just clicked, and it just made sense. And I knew I, in that first couple days, I just I knew. Um, and then, of course, I, I freaked out because <laughs> this came out of nowhere. And, um, yeah, my first response to doing that was I thought it would be a good idea to, uh, to pump myself full of estrogen with birth control, despite having tried that when I was a lot younger and it really didn't go well. Um, I, yeah, that with my depression was not not a good mix, but I was, I was freaking out, so I decided to do it again, um, and yeah, it really didn't go any better, <laughs> I had, uh, for, so I, I came out to myself, and then for about two weeks after that, I had probably one of the worst depressions I've ever had in my life, it was awful, <laughs> and so I'm dealing with, oh my god, what the hell was that, and now my mood stuff is, like, off the charts, so, yeah, when I finally just decided, screw it, and stop taking the, the lady hormones, um, it, uh, my mind cleared up and I started this really slow and steady journey to get to the point where I was okay with it. Um, and that's, that's another story. <laughs> but, um, yeah, yeah, it, it took a while to get here to, to accept it and to embrace it, but here I am and I'm, I'm stoked on it. Um, yeah, one thing that I also like to say as much as I can is that I wasn't at all born in the wrong body. I hate that. And I mean, to each their own, you know. 
but um, for me, no, I don't think I was born in the wrong body at all. There's nothing wrong with my body. And I think that's a message that we really, really need to say to trans people is there's nothing wrong with your body. There's parts that I want to change and there's parts that I am changing. But, um, you know, the fact that I was born into this particular body has given me this perspective. I mean, I've experienced womanhood. I'm going to experience manhood. And I think, you know, we're, we're incredibly well-rounded and wise people for it. Um, so yeah, anyways, that's, that's my soapbox <laughs> for the day. Um, I don't think I really have anything else to report so far. Uh, so I'm gonna stop it here. Um, thanks everybody who's, who's checked out my first video. You guys are awesome. Totally made my day. And, um, yeah, we'll, we'll talk to you guys later.